even though it was so scary, it was amazing to see the community come together. A family in the Cedar Creek area stood to protect their property alongside friends, neighbors, and firefighters when the Karameas Creek wildfire flared up and descended closer to them on Wednesday night. It's been crazy. We've been all over the place. We've kind of just been waiting the fire out. And last night it was chaos. Yeah, came from nowhere. Yeah, we were just joking about how it was so calm and like we we're having dinner we were, yeah having dinner and then all of a sudden we went down to the bottom of the road and it just started coming straight down and then that's when everything shit hit the fan like right on the like right above the barn and then right, right on my the mom's house down there it was right right in the trees so they just did amazing job the firefighters too. yeah and all the firefighters thank you so much you're awesome you're amazing while the property was put on evacuation order, the family said they all had to stay to look after the farm. And I mean, this is our this is our Three everything. Three generations like, of our family ranch, and yeah, we can't leave our animals. Like we have cows right down there, and our horses, and yeah, yeah. horses, livestock. Like we have 200 head of cattle somewhere on the range out there, so we're just hoping they're okay and they got out. But yeah, the family is incredibly grateful to everyone who came out to help them. I think we're just tired. Yeah. A little over, like the little overwhelmed, the adrenaline's kind of settling and you're just like, Ugh. like, yeah. Yeah, everyone's exhausted. But great, yeah. so it's all still here, yeah. Yeah, we have enough food to feed an army. Are the community <laughs> still bringing in <laughs> truckloads of food? For Castnet News and this Milkamine, I'm Casey Richardson.